details on the money and what's going to happen now. <laughs> It's an incitement charge uh, under common law uh, to trespassing, they say. There is a complainant. Uh, as far as we are concerned, it's uh, one of the white farmers here in Newcastle. Uh, uh, and it is following the president's statement after the case of the Writers' Assemblies Act. So the court has agreed that uh, the new date and the matter be postponed to the 6th of July. Uh, and uh, as you saw, it didn't take more than five minutes. And that's what we mean about the waste of time uh, of the president and the leadership of the EFF. Um, they are uh, trying to frustrate our ability to go and uproot uh, the corrupt ANC on the ground, to go and fight uh, on the ground uh, against the white monopoly capital. Uh, 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 and as a result, we always have to come to court, uh, 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 you know, which is basically a waste of time. And I'm just saying, um, they have charged the CIC now with a different charge, right? Um, what do you say about that? that it's substantially not a different charge. What these charges are about is to try and silence us uh, around what is basically a Freedom Charter demand that the people shall have the right to occupy land wherever they choose. And this is the most important thing that all of us must keep in mind, is that uh, it has to do with being silenced around the question of land occupation. If we are here because we are in full support of all the land occupation struggles, if we are here charged around the matter of the fact that we agree that land must be expropriated, then why is all those people of the ANC as well not in court? Why is the NPA not charging Zuma, who has also been going around you know, agreeing to the question of uh, of land occupation. The Minister of uh, uh, Land and Agrarian Reform, Kukile Nguinti, should be in court as well. So you can see the double standard, as it were, on the part of our National Prosecuting Authority. Why would you be charged for advocating uh, uh, for land occupation in an obvious environment uh, of colonial land ownership that continues 24, uh, 23 years into democracy?